Hi everyone, welcome to another Plan With Me video. This is Elise of Plan With Elise, and today we are doing another vacation-themed spread. I know that you saw, or hopefully you watched, my classic spread from this week where I talked about the vacation I'm going on, um, and I'm gonna do that in my big as well. So I bought these printable stickers from Darby of Planet Darby, where we have this set here, the vitamin C, words never sell. You're seeing some weird shadowing because of course I made a mistake when printing because that's just how I do. And um, these sailboats. So there's one, two, three. I printed this twice and I also made a bigger version of the, sail the uh, lighthouse because I really wanted a big lighthouse as kind of the feature of this spread. So I printed this on Avery clear sticker paper. This is the same paper that I used for the ice cream spread in July, I believe, um, which I will link in the description of this video. I like this paper because it's clear. However, when I print with it, it it's a little bit less vibrant. The colors are a little bit less vibrant than they would be if I were using um, white paper, like white sticker paper, not clear sticker paper. So I'm just using my knife here to cut off this big piece because this is what I want to really be like the centerpiece of my spread. And I know that I could use scissors to cut it. I feel like this might just be a little bit easier right now. I don't know, we'll see. So my thought is that this is going to go like right over here. And if that's the case, that means that I need to cover up a lot of these white lines. So I'm not super concerned about this being a crazy functional spread because I will be away most of the week, but I, I do want to make sure that I have room to kind of note what we did and where we went and those kinds of things. So I will be including boxes in addition to the decor. I might even include lines that I could use to sort of journal with a little bit. We'll see. I think I'm also going to cover up this part over here so that I can just really go all the way to the edge of the page. And of course I'm using my Univault Signo to cover. I just think it makes a nice smooth line. I might actually cover this bottom one too. So this is definitely going to be more of a decorative spread than a functional one. I know how I feel about massive stickers. So I'm a little nervous. It was really stressful doing it on camera last time, but I think it ended up okay. All right, so as I'm kind of looking here, I think I'm gonna need to cover up. We're just gonna hold this up so it does not stick to anything. I'm gonna need to cover up a little bit up here, over here as well. And then this would be a great time for wax paper. This one we're just gonna cover up fully. Again, really holding this up because we know that stickers like to stick on things that we don't intend them to. Oh, probably this one too, oh my goodness. What's funny about where I'm putting this is that I'll actually be home these days. <laughs> but I am working really hard to be ahead so that I don't have a ton of work to do like the day that I get home. I think I get home Friday. So we're gonna take this lighthouse. I'm gonna put my hand on like as much of it as I can to kind of hold it down until I'm ready to place it exactly where I want it to go. All right. And I think we've got it. I like that. I like it. It reminds me of a family vacation we took years ago to the Hamptons where we did the lighthouse tour, or not lighthouse tour, but we went on, walked up to the top of the lighthouse in Montauk. I feel like lighthouses are just so, I don't know, perfect for a beachy seaside vacation like we are going on this time. And we are going to Narragansett, Rhode Island. Okay. Now, I feel like you would probably prefer me to just cut these out first, right? I feel like that probably is gonna be easier than trying to cut through them all on camera. So let me do that and I'll be back in a little bit. Okay, so not every sticker is cut out, but I feel like it's enough to start. Whereas I didn't wanna spend way too much time cutting out every single sticker if I wasn't entirely sure that I was going to use all of them. 
So what I did here with these um, surfboards is I actually cut out the sand because I want to combine this sticker with the sand one or with the surfboards one, but I want to put it in the sand. Okay. This is why I like, I struggle with regular stickers, let alone printable ones. <laughs> All right. So I feel like I probably could have cut that out a little bit better. Um, let's put this end up right over here and that sand is so weird because of how I cut it. So instead, sorry, I know I said I wasn't going to do all the cutting on here. We're going to use this one. I'm not going to be able to do it perfectly, uh, actually, because this is a little bit transparent. But I'm going to do it to the best of my ability. Although it's hard to tell what's transparent and what's the backing that I accidentally printed. So we're just going to be in this struggle together. Yeah, so this is definitely not what I wanted because we're going to have that color up there. So the way that it's designed is perfect. It's just that I'm not using it for the original, like with the original design. So that's why it's getting a little, a little weird. I think that's fine. I don't need it to be perfect. So it's not, it's not my thing. All right, so I did cut out the quotes individually. Um, I think that what I want to start to do is let's maybe bring in a red box. So I have the Mojo Jojo red and yellow and blue stickers to match this really nicely. So I think that we will put this red box over here. And again, I don't necessarily know what my plans are. So we're just kind of going with it without fully knowing what's going to happen each day. Because I don't know if you go on vacations where see, um, you know everything that's going to happen, but we're just kind of, we're just kind of going. <laughs> so we'll see. There are going to be some things that are planned, but not every moment of every day. It's not like an itinerary type of trip. Um, let's bring in this, seize the day. And I know we're getting a little bit of overlap because I didn't cut these perfectly. And then let's bring in a yellow box. Because what I can do is like, let's say this is a beach day. Well, I can write beach day and then I can also kind of note what we had for dinner or if we went out for ice cream or something like that. So I think we'll do that there. And then I did cut out some sailboats. So let's see. Hmm, trying to decide which one to start with. Let's take this one. I kind of like the idea of the sailboats being over here at the bottom, but I don't have water. <laughs> and I don't know that I'm creative enough to play around with it. I feel like I could maybe take a highlighter and do that. I don't know that that's really me. So we might just have sailboats. I don't know, maybe they should come along this way. Now I'm a little stuck. I was originally just like, we're just going to put the sailboats down, but I think we're just going to put them down because I don't want to try to do something crazy creative and it ends up being a disaster, which could totally happen for me. So we're just going to play around and not take this spread too seriously. I don't know if I ever really take a spread seriously. I kind of like the idea of sort of doing sailboats like throughout. I know that that's not how they work. But I think that it could be fun. So if I wanted to put this one here, we are going to cover up this line. And I'll need to cover up a little bit over here. And then let's see how far across I need to go. Just there. This might be weird. All right, we're gonna we're gonna do it. Now, <laughs> taking this yellow sailboat, and this one is gonna go up here. 
I feel like it's a little bit more like a magical sailboat spread of whatever, wherever it and wherever life leads you is sort of where we're at with this one. I think that's pretty. I don't know what it is. I know, again, it's not whatever. We're just having fun. All right, I don't know why I'm making excuses for where I'm putting my stickers in my planner, <laughs> but sometimes it happens. Okay, however, now I'm realizing, well, I only have two more sailboats because I didn't print out more. I always could, but I don't know that I'll need to. So we're just gonna kind of continue this path. This part, I don't necessarily, oops. I was gonna say I don't necessarily have to cover because it's a dark blue, but we'll do some of it anyway. Oh, and this part. About right there. And one more. Where is it? Here, this is a little one. I don't even think I cut this out yet, sorry. We'll get this up. I like using this knife for it. I think it's just faster. I did cut out the quotes with a scissor, but I feel like this is just a little bit quicker. And if you want to be precise, this allows you to be a little bit more precise than a scissor might. I feel like this one might just kind of hang out right over here. I don't know. I don't dislike it. I think it's different and I'm going to stick with that. I might bring in these little guys. What do we think about that? Should I do that? I feel like half of them are already cut out because they were pieces that I was cutting around. I don't know that I have enough. Let's see, between both sheets. Mm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 10, 11, 12, 13. So maybe like about two in each and we're just gonna kind of have this like go across like here, sort of to draw the line, maybe. I don't know, <laughs> I don't know, I can't. I'm feeling indecisive right now with my planner or with this spread but we're gonna make it fun. Okay, this is the part of printable stickers where I feel like I should have just spent the time beforehand cutting them all out. So let's, we've got this little one. It doesn't go, I don't know, okay. This one's gonna go here. I probably need to cover up these lines. That might be what's like breaking it up in my mind. And then let's get these guys out. Sorry, I'm forgetting to speak. <laughs> Just trying to get through this part of it. I feel like some people make putting spreads together look so simple and seamless. And sometimes mine are, sometimes they come together quickly. But when I'm dealing with 1400 little pieces of stickers, I'm not, I'm not feeling seamless or experienced or anything like that. And I'm not in a rush. Today is Sunday. I am relaxed but I also am a little overwhelmed by all the stuff that's in front of me right now on my desk. You know that, you know what I mean? All right, I think one more and we are set. So I was having trouble peeling this one. Maybe I can do it now. Let's try that again. Okay, I might add in more. I think we're okay for now. Let's go to some boxes. So I have that big red one there. I don't necessarily wanna do a big blue one. So maybe we'll take a square blue combined with a square yellow. 
I should be able to fit both of these. Let's do yellow first since that blue quote is right here. I'm not going to have the room for that size. So I'll put this on the side and get a smaller blue one in the meantime. And then I actually want to grab my checklist stencil that I know is hiding under here somewhere. And I want to draw some lines so that I can journal a little bit about the day. All right, that gives me a little bit of space. And then I think I'll do the same thing over here, but maybe we bring in an anchor. Like right there. I feel like an anchor should be going at the bottom of the boat, not at the top of the boat, but these boats are floating boats. So we've got some lines there. And then down here, let's bring maybe red back. This is gonna be too big, so let's go for a different red, a different size. We'll go for the square right here. All right, it's happening, right? It's coming together. It's starting to work. <laughs> okay, now up here, Let's do a yellow box. You see like when I start to get energized, I feel like the video should start with a lot of energy and mine don't, so I think they do. And then I'm like, oh, I don't know what I'm doing. And then as time goes on, the energy picks up a little bit. It's like the rhythm of a video. I think trying to figure out like how to film and create and speak and entertain and Think about what's on my to-do list all at the same time can be a little bit challenging sometimes. All right, we're gonna bring these lines in. And I'm thinking I might also do a highlighted line a little bit. I wish it, these weren't both red. I think I'm gonna peel this red one up. And we're gonna put down the blue one that we had on the side before. And I feel like the addition of yellow in here definitely makes it feel less um, 4th of July because we've got the yellow. So it's not just like a red, white, and blue spread. All right, let's do a checklist here on Friday, which may end up being a real checklist depending on what time I get home. And then I think we'll do a blue box. So I might do a full size blue box. I say full size because this sticker book is sized for a classic happy planner, which it would be full size in that. It's just a little bit smaller in the big. Do we not like the blue and the blue? Probably not. All right, let's try yellow. There's a lot of sticker peeling up happening here. Are we still filming? We are, okay. The sun is like heavily on my um, phone so I couldn't see without standing up if we were still rolling. All right, now let's do maybe a smaller blue one. Like one of these size over here. Okay, um, back to Saturday. So checklist wise, this is really the only spot I have Saturday. So I think Saturday and Sunday are both gonna get checklists in this top box. And maybe we'll do a couple higher so that I can get four in here. All right, and then let's get a box here. So I had that big blue one. I think maybe we will bring it in right here. Just enough space to have the blue with the lighthouse. All right. Um, I only used one quote. Oh my goodness. I totally forgot that I had all these quotes. Hmm. I mean, I don't know that I 100% need them all. I mean, I really don't have room. Like I could bring this down here just to bring in something. Let's see. 
time to get a little naughty not when I'm with my family. <laughs> We're not going to use that quote on a family trip. I like it, but not in this one. If you never try to sail, you'll forever be just a motorboat. You could bring this one in, like right over here. There's a lot of blue right there, and it's definitely crooked. I'm laughing at the time to get naughty sticker. How about this? Not all who wander are lost. Oops. We've got a little bit on this sticker and you can see that it's there. So let's trim that. I know there's a ton of other stickers that I'm not using, like the crabs and the rope and the boat and all of that. I'm just not sure that I have the room for it in this spread, but the great thing is I'll still have the stickers because I already printed them. And I'll also always have them because they are digital downloads. So let's think about the sidebar. I'd like the idea of doing something like favorite memories, maybe from the trip. So let's take um, I want to cover up this week's list unless we put another sticker there to kind of cover it. Do I have anything else cut out here? I don't, but that doesn't mean I can't. So how fun would it be to put this little anchor there, but it still won't be covered. So we are going to cut out, not anchor, um, life save, what is this called? It's not a lifeboat life raft. I can't think of the word. I don't know what is wrong with me. You know what I'm talking about. You know what this is. But we have to cover up that part before I can put this on. So if you could only see the sides of my desk right now. All right. We're going to cover this guy. Oh, what was happening at that? All right. Life raft. No, not a life raft. Oh my goodness. What is this called? This is killing me. Maybe we don't want to do red. Maybe we do blue. Could do red there. We'll do red here. And then a yellow. And these might just be like memorable moments or, um, this video is it this week's video I don't remember when you'll see a video that's an after the pen where like I just wrote what I was thinking about that week so the sidebar can always be figured out or priorities top three priorities something like that okay let me stand up and just get an actual visual view of this oh I mentioned I wanted to maybe highlight some of the lines so let me take a look at my highlighting options. I ended up grabbing a yellow mild liner brush pen. I thought the yellow would be just a nice pop of color here. So we are just gonna highlight these. Looks like I cut the paper a little bit when I was slicing. Definitely don't recommend putting your planner underneath pages that you are cutting. I'm just trying to keep my elbow down to make it as straight of a line as possible, which is why I'm also turning the page because I can't do it vertically like that. It has to be slanted. All right, so a little housekeeping while I am away. I will have videos up every single day. Um, I've been working really hard to make sure that that can still happen. So there are some releases coming up this week. There are, what else is coming up? I'd have to look at my planner, but it's towards the end of the month. So it's possible that there'll be, oh, budget videos. If you want to take a look and learn more about how I budget and how I use my budgeting planner. Um, and of course, this was a month where there are videos every single day. So if you were like, what, Elise? I don't know, you had videos every day. I have a whole channel for you to look back through. I don't know how active I'll be on Instagram while I'm away. I just want to enjoy this time with my family. But of course, 
You can help support me by watching my videos, clicking the thumbs up button. Um, what else could you do? You could subscribe to my channel and, and shop my affiliate links as well. So, oh, by the way, the sticker paper is going to be linked. These stickers, like I said, are from Planet Darby. I believe I used Ruth's discount code, so I will put that in the description as well if you are interested in these for an upcoming trip. Um, I really like the spread. I think it's really fun. I'm excited. Whoops, we've got a little piece of, there we go, backing here. All right, thank you so much for watching. Please do give this video a thumbs up, and I will see you next time.